hello everyone welcome back to our channel thank you for always stopping by in today's video i want to share with us a recipe you can use to open your ways to remove negative energies to remove evil eyes to remove any kind of blockage making things not to work for you be it financially and otherwise but in case you're tuning in for the first time or you're seeing my face for the first time you're highly welcome kindly hit the red subscribe button to make yourself a full member of this family like my videos share my videos and if you're a returning subscriber thank you i really appreciate keep supporting the channel by liking my videos and sharing my videos you can follow me on other social media handles on facebook as solution empire on tiktok as solution empire one follow me so that you learn everything you need to know about spiritualism so i want to talk about things you can do if things are not working well for you what you can do, how you can use mainly gloves to open your financial ways, to remove negative energies, to remove evil eyes. You know, most of us today are not progressing because of lots of negative energies, lots of evil eyes, lots of evil things around us. And you know that when you have negative energies around you, there's nothing that will work for you. It's just like when you're, a when you're dirty and you wear a white cloth, it's going to stain that cloth immediately. So when you, remove, when you take your bath and wear a white cloth, you won't see any stain on the cloth. That is how your spiritual life is when you have lots of negative energies. No matter how you struggle, no matter how you pray, no matter the kind of things you do, if you don't break those yokes, if you don't break or remove those things, making things not to work for you, believe you me, even if you like 200 days fasting and praying, it's not going to work. What do I mean? Some of you would think I'm against praying. No, that is what I want to tell us now. Imagine you having maybe a financial cost issue and you're praying for fi uh, financial open doors it's not going to be possible what you should concentrate in praying is how god should how you're going to deliver yourself from that causes hindering you from not making money that is how you will pray for those things to come to pass and that is why this channel was created so that you will learn how to channel your prayers and how to get things done at the right way if your problem is financial issues Whenever you're praying, make sure you pray against it. Don't pray for financial favor. Don't pray for open doors when you know the root cause of your problem. Pray that God should deliver you from that problem and watch how other things will fall in places. If you break that yoke, maybe that cause is following you or that spiritual spouse, if you go to settle it, financial open doors, you won't even be the one to pray for it. It will come because it's those things that is blocking you from getting to that place you want to be or that thing you want to achieve. If your environment or your spiritual life is dirty, there is no how you receive favor. So start by doing cleansing to remove those negative energies. So I want to show us a, a cleansing you can do to remove negative energies and equally use this particular cleansing to attract good things to your life, wealth, wealth, anything you want, good luck, favor. Okay, so when the negative, on the other hand, it will be removing the negative energies. On the other hand, it will be attracting good things to you. So the first thing you're going to get for me is clothes. This is my clothes. You can see how it, it is. You can get this from market or supermarket. Another thing you're going to be needing is sugar. Any kind of sugar, cube sugar, powder sugar, brown sugar. Sugar is a sweetener in a, a spiritualism. That is what it means. So this one is garlic garlic is very very powerful to fight any kind of spiritual battle be it ancestral courses witchcraft uh, anything it is garlic is very powerful likewise close close is very very good to return back to sender to liberate yourself from anything that is holding you to wash away negative forces bringing you down so when you combine these two garlic and close it's going to on, uh, be fighting negative energies. It's going to remove any kind of cause. It's going to return if if uh, your problem is somebody that did it. It's going to return it back to the sender as you're doing this. And the sugar, on the other hand, will be attracting good things to you. So the question is how to use these three ingredients to remove these negative energies and to equally attract good luck to our lives. The first thing you're going to do every morning you're going to get your clothes. You can powder it so that you take a little, okay? Get enough clothes, powder it as in grind it or blend it or pound it, make it to be in a powdered form. Then get your garlic. You can use the 
powdered one if you don't have the fresh one but make sure this garlic okay if you have the fresh one you can use it so when you powder your clothes get half teaspoon of clothes get a cube of sugar if you're using the powdered one get a teaspoon of sugar then if you're using the powdered uh, garlic get a teaspoon of it if you're using the fresh one you can use three pieces of it crush it inside your baking water every morning and every night remember what will make this thing to work for you is your faith and the way you command it to work for you I tell people you have power in your mouth. It depends on what you want to use it to do. If you want to use it for good, go, it, it will work for you. If you want to use it for bad, it's left for you. So when you mix it in your, your baking water, your clothes, your garlic, and your sugar inside your baking water, begin to speak. Tell God to remove every forces after your life that is making you not to prosper, that is making you to go back, that is making things not to work the way it's supposed to work. You are looking for work. You're looking for your life partner. You're looking for money to start business. You are doing business, but nothing is working. You are married. You don't have children. Your husband is looking for a job. Your husband have a shop, but nothing is working there. That God should remove those negative forces, those negative energies, those evil eyes, those evil manipulation, those causes that is after your life, after your family, after your husband, after your business. Those things that is making things not to work the way it's supposed to work. That God should use this garlic close to remove it and make everything to be new in your life. And you should use this sugar to sweeten your life, to sweeten your health. There are people that are sick today. Their problem is just their sickness is eating all their money. All the things they have is going to the, uh, their sickness. At the end of the day, they are still sick. Tell God to use this to remove those ne negative energies after your health. That is making you to spend every couple you have on your health. And use sugar to sweeten your life. You can use brown sugar for those that will ask me. You can use brown sugar. You do this in the morning, you do it in the night. If you're a Christian and you wish to pray with Psalm, Psalm 23 is very, very good for this. You can equally use Psalm 2, Psalm 23 and Psalm 2. Read it inside the bathing water and use it to bathe. By the grace of God, when you do this for seven days, do it from the one to the seventh day, do not break it, okay? You will see how things will begin to work for you. And please note, when you're doing this recipe, any evil person around you will make a way, may, may just want to pick a fight with you or will not want to talk with you again. Two things are involved, they will run away from you or they will want to fight with you. Please do not fight. Know that your recipe is affecting them because of the negative energies they are carrying. Even in your place of work, any evil person around you that is after your promotion, that is after your stay in that place, will fight you or want to, will not want to see you. When, the, when you're coming, the person will avoid you. So don't force yourself to make friends with people when they start avoiding you, when you start using this recipe. And when you do it completely, you will see how things will start you know, turning around for good in your life. This is very simple but very, very powerful. Try it and make sure you share your testimony under my comment section or on my WhatsApp number. I've come to the end of today's video. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.